Hey guys, if you're searching how to service the transmission on your E70 BMW X5, I will provide a link on the description of this video so that you can go and watch it. It's a very detailed guide, and I think it will be unnecessary for me to make my own guide given the fact that this one's so good already. But what I want to show you here is that uh, there's an issue that I came across, and it made this job significantly more difficult than it would have been in the first place. So if you look at the top portion of this video where you see that cross member, that cross member is right in front of four of the bolts that you need to remove to remove the oil pan. When I started this job, when I took the pen off, I was prying the, the, the transmission up against the cross member so that I could get enough room just to slide a bit because there was no room uh, for me to place any other tools in there. It was only enough for a single T40 bit to fit through there. Because of the fact that you cannot fit anything else in there, uh, you are basically forced to use a quarter inch wrench um, where you put the bit on the close ended side, uh, wrap it with some electrical tape so that the bit doesn't fall off of the wrench every time you're trying to use it. Um, you also want to lift up on the transmission itself very, very, very slightly. You only want to lift maybe about a quarter inch, maybe half an inch at most, um, just to give you enough space to slide that bit in and out with the wrench because it's so close together to that cross member. Also, the way you're going to be able to torque those screws back on properly is by attaching a torque wrench to the open-ended end of that wrench. Thanks for watching. This is where I'll end the video. Um, but again, I just wanted to show you guys what you might come across to prevent you from starting this job and then having your vehicle down for a longer period of time than you intended to. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.